Hi, I'm Miley Oye. I'm a member of Google's Webmaster Support Team, here to help you choose the verification method in Webmaster Tools that's easiest for you. All methods discussed in this video can lead to the same successful verification. Once you've selected your method of choice, please then navigate to the resources available to guide you through the specific verification process. Verifying ownership of your site in Webmaster Tools provides you and Google a secure channel for giving and receiving information. For example, Google can show you more confidential information, such as the search queries that bring visitors to your site. And by verifying ownership, you'll have privileges to do things like adjust geotargeting settings to associate your site with the audience of a particular country. Verification doesn't affect your site's performance in Google search results. By now, you've likely added your site in Webmaster Tools. Your site is where you tell your friends or customers to go to see your content and should match what is seen in the browser. All types of sites are eligible for verifying ownership with Google Webmaster Tools. A site can include a subdomain or hostname like mysite.example.com or it can be the domain without a www like www.example.com or the domain without the www like example.com or a subdirectory like www.example.com slash my site or www.example.com slash subdirectory my site or some combination. There are some cases such as if you're using Blogger, Google Sites, or a hoster or provider who integrated with Webmaster Tools, when your site may be automatically verified on your behalf, you're all set and can start exploring Webmaster Tools. If not, let's figure out the right method for you to verify ownership. Verifying ownership means proving to Google that you, in fact, own the site and aren't, say, a competitor trying to gain access to valuable statistics and information. For more beginner-level site owners, especially if you haven't had a chance to try it out before, verification can be a little tricky. The good news is that once you're a verified owner, you can easily delegate other owners or managers of your site without their having to go through the same process. There are several methods to verify ownership. There's a recommended method that may be the easiest. And then there are also more in alternate methods. For those who have several sites to verify, such as a multinational site that has de.example.com, jp.example.com, and say us.example.com, you can select the option domain name provider. If you don't see your provider listed, select other. For all other site owners, let's look at this drop-down list as well. Please check for your provider. Your domain provider or registrar is commonly the company from whom you purchased your domain and where your website is hosted. If you see your provider, using the customized directions listed is usually the easiest way to verify ownership. If you didn't see your provider, or if that method was unsuccessful for you, then let's talk about the HTML file upload method. HTML file upload is a good option for those who can easily upload files to their root directory, meaning the first or main directory of their site. For example, if my site is www.example.com, I would upload an HTML file to my root directory at www.example.com slash and then my file here. Or if my site is mysite.example.com slash subdirectory, then my root directory would be at mysite.example.com slash subdirectory, my file here. If you're a site owner who can upload files from either your site administration tool or by FTP or terminal or shell access, then HTML file upload may be a great option for you. Another option for site verification is adding a HTML meta tag. If you're familiar with writing HTML code for your web page, then this is a great option. Last, if your site already uses Google Analytics and you're an administrator, 
please see the Google Analytics verification method. Each of the methods we've covered have their own article to guide you through the process. Once your site is verified, you'll see success on your screen. Now, when you log into Webmaster Tools, you'll notice your site shows Manage Site rather than Not Verified. For newly verified sites, you might not see a lot of data just yet, but if you come back within a few days, you'll likely notice more interesting data. That covers all of our verification methods. We hope you are able to determine the easiest method for you to verify ownership. Thanks for watching.